Have a nice day, everyone. Now, we will explain what is the meaning of standard deviation. I uh, post before this record an explanation about the standard deviation importance in the our work. Here is the standard deviation here. This is the mean or the average, and this is the deviation here. You look here, one sigma, two sigma, three sigma. In my calculation, I take the standard deviation equal the average plus three sigma. Another uh, companies take plus two sigma, but I prefer to take three sigma to take many uh, data. Okay, now we will go to the our report. Here is the definition. The definition here, the standard deviation here, and this is the alert value which you ask about me, ask me about that many times. This is the alert value equal the average or the mean plus three times standard deviation. If you took two, this is up to you, but I prefer three times the standard deviation. The standard deviation calculation here, this is the formula and this is the explanation for each symbol. And here note, I calculate this calculation by Excel, Microsoft Excel. If you go to function and took statistical, statics statistics and go to standard deviation sct d e v i will show you sooner the pilot report rate here the pilot report bear 100 revenue departure but the component bear 1000 flight hours 1,000 flight hours. This is cycles and this is hours. Also revenue and revenue. Okay. So here we calculate it by Excel. I will show you now. Please wait. Here it's. This is explained before. This is the rate what we call before. And this is the component. Okay. Also, this is the quart. Please wait. Please wait. Come here. This is the component. This is the look here calculation of system alert value. The alert value equal the average plus three times standard deviation. Now you can make like me. This is the month November, December, January from the end, the end of the year. This is the revenue departure per month, every month departure how many revenue departure here and put here and this is the revenue departure of three months here three months add the three the last three months and put it here 
okay here add one two three and put it here here plus one two three and put it here okay i will show you here in my sum of d9 until f9 this is the three months okay so the first step make these three rows for the month and monthly departure revenue departure and this is every three months here okay look here and i'll put here i put here the standard deviation and here the average and here three times standard deviation and this is the alert value which we call average plus three so i will add this this plus this because i bought three multiply here so i will add this cell for this cell to get this okay so look here i will this is the average plus three by this i will show you here r cell r15 plus s15 show okay this is the r15 and this is s15 so this is the alert value here then after this three rows and this is three columns we look here this is the pilot reports and take care you must put not pilot reports but all reports as we explained before this is at the 21 air conditioning here is the number of number of reports here number of reports here by reps per month here rate per 1100 revenue departure look here no no events no reports no reports no reports but here is here some reports here i just look here L, L, L14 divided L10 by 100. What is L? Look here, where L? This is L. Okay. After this, at the end of the month, at the end of the month, we will calculate here. Look here. this is the average means this is a thunder deviation which we get it look here's the formula what take care here equal standard deviation multiply this is the calculation for the cells from f20 to o20 f20 to o20 where the f20 we will show you this is f f f20 here to then the end of the year okay and this is for an example for system reliability if we go to the component component reliability this is a component this is the component also three rows for the month and revenue flight hours not departure not flights but flight hours put here each month here and this is the three months here okay this 
equal one, two, three, put the three months and put it here. Here, take the three months before one, two, three, and put it here. Okay, then any component you have, this is the component, such as actuator outlet in chapter 21, and how many removals here, put the removals. The same thing as the system reliability. Okay, and this is the standard deviation, and this is the average, and three times standard deviation and here. If you want to, to see what is about the standard deviation, as example here, if I in this cell and go to formula, this is formula, and this is the function, and you put here S T V okay S T D S T D S T D S T D E V okay the capital S T D E V. Okay, if you would go, as uh, this is S T S T D V. So you put here equal this open bracket. Put the cell from the beginning of the year until the cell of the end of the year you can calculate the standard deviation okay then the standard deviation multiply by three if you want the average the same thing if you call mean m e a n and go This is the mean. If I put average A V E R A G go and this is the average here. So you it is very easy to calculate the average and the standard deviation, then you can easily, very simple to calculate alert value for the component or for the system. Okay. Now, I would think that is, we finished the explanation for the aircraft reliability program report. Thank you very much. Any question you ask, we can you ask me, and I am waiting for any comment and any questions. And if the contents of the tube, please subscribe with me to to see anything, any new thing. Again, thank you very much and goodbye.